Bournemouth number nine there for Manchester City, who are attacking the goal to our left. And indeed, in his pre-match talk, the manager John Bond was calling in his own words for a little more devilment from Manchester City today, who won their first three games, but then lost at Notts County in midweek. So if it's a big day for Chris Jones, it's a pretty big day as well for Ricky Villa, now getting on for the first time at the start since his return from Argentina. Hartford. Well, that looked like a foul, yes, by Mabbott on Jones. And a free kick to Manchester City. Clements has lined up the wall. He hopes efficiently. Four in it. Bond and Power over the ball. Reeves is wide. And Caton is menacingly placed along to the left. The pass may be to him, but nice power with a shot deflected. And a chance here, surely. And it's tucked away by Baker. And uh, the former Southampton man puts Manchester City into the lead. His first goal for his new club. And the deflection that put Spurs all over the place. Deflection there from Powers' kick suddenly allows Baker to go in. He goes round the keeper, Ray Clemens, doesn't really hit it cleanly, but it's in the back of the net. It's a hot afternoon, and you can see the perspiration there on the city defender, Bobby McDonald. Players would expect to lose, I would think, at least four or five pounds in weight in the course of a really hot afternoon like this. Perriman just getting in by the byline. Via hoping to turn it back. Archibald looking for support. And a good shot by Gary Brook, turned away well by Alex Williams. Strikes a superb ball, Gary Brook. And that was one of them. And the 20 year old goalkeeper, Alex Williams, was equal to it. Hit firmly and save well. Baker. Hanson with the cross, Jones almost getting in with the header and Bobby McDonald was up there as well. That would have been some comeback to White Hart Lane for Chris Jones. And he wasn't uh, far from just getting the touch that was required. Reeves trying to turn Perryman, succeeds in finding a yard for himself, but it was Price's header away. Now can Brook get going? Asa Hartford only hit it against Brook and now it's gone for Archibald and Brook's run continues and saved again by the keeper. Great run by Gary Brook. Fed all the way by his teammates but it was he who made the running. And once again the keeper was able to parry it and Kevin Bond I think it was who came in and got it away, yes. Hartford, a little too deliberate, and Archibald can take possession. The back heel finds Brooks, the pass now finds Hazard. And the shot is turned away again by the keeper, and that must have been moving a little bit in the air. Struck well, and again, Alex Williams pushing it away. And in fact, Lacey going off the field. It's only for the doctor to have a look at him, maybe uh, stitches. Hartford's cross, and Price not really bothered, although it's a corner for Manchester City. Baker's come forward, and he, in fact, will take the corner, curling it in towards Ray Clements. Towards the near post, in fact. Brook with a chance of getting it away, deftly nicking it over power, and finding Hazard back to Brook again, now to Archibald, a chance of a good break out here. As Crooks takes it up, now can Crooks make the equaliser here? Good save by the keeper, and a great run by Spurs and Garth Crooks. But the keeper did well. It was a very good break, calling for good, accurate passing and good, aggressive running. It got it all, and Crooks' shot was on target until Williams got there and pushed it away. of releasing Price. Here's Crooks. Price again. A foul by Herida. A free kick to Spurs. This is normally where they would look to a huddle, of course. To dip and swerve and cause distress. 
But at the moment, it's Villa, who is no mean taker of a free kick himself, Mike Hazard. And it's noticeable that Gary Brook is standing just off this situation as well. To the right. And Hazard purporting to be arguing with the referee. It may be a decoy thing. It flows for Brook. Just wide. Exciting moment, though. But the wall was lined up well. That's quite evident. And the shot goes wide a bit as one player attacks the ball and just wide of the goal. They see. Brooks. That's it. Via. Can he finish it off? Oh, the keeper did well. By Ricky Via, who came on as a sub on Wednesday night against Southampton and scored within three minutes of coming on. Looked as though he might have added another one there through a crowd of players. It was past the keeper, in fact, before Williams grabbed it at the second go. Galvin, Spurs keeping up this pressure, but they just can't find the right finishing touch. Crooks, Mabbott. Crooks again. Little pass for Archibald, played in turn. Oh, great shot there by Perryman. Thought that was going to scream into the top corner for a moment. Played back by Archibald for his skipper, hit it first time. And wide. Spurs coming forward again, still searching for this equaliser, finding Gary Brook. Now, can Garth Brooks get on to this one? Via, maybe? Brook, saved again! And Hazard is going off from the midfield. Well, he's had that experience before. At Wembley, as well as at White Hart Lane. And Graham Roberts comes on. At the same time, Manchester City are making their substitution, and Chris Jones goes off, and Dennis Stewart comes on. Hartford. Stewart. Hartford. Possessed. Can this be number two? It'll be an amazing one if it is. Oh, my word, what an amazing goal. But it was Roberts' error, and then an amazing lob by Graham Baker, who gets his second goal of the game, and surely now ties it up for Manchester City. The ball played in here to Graham Roberts. He was warned by the crowd, but Baker was there. Suddenly he was through, confronted by Clements, and then that. Perriman tried for all he was worth to get it out. But he couldn't. Well, that was astonishing. And now Spurs are really up against it with the eight minutes that are left. Galvin. Needs something very quickly now, Tottenham, to give them a chance to get back in. And they've almost got it, they have! And Mabbott has scored for Tottenham. came in and Roberts I think it was on the far side got it across the face of the goal Mabbott went diving in bravely and Spurs have... might drop for Lee and it's rushed with the header pushed out by